Hey guys, Steph here again um, with episode 5 of EMC farming. Um, this is the flax farm, which is also quite commonly known. Um, it creates 96 EMC a second, approximately, which is not quite as much as the dark room, um, but a lot of still a lot more than the cactus farm, the egg farm, well, chicken farm, cobblestone generator. Um, this is quite smaller quite a lot smaller than the dark room which is a plus of course um, but machine wise it costs almost the same it's not really but here you need um, three condensers where in the dark room you only need two condensers and the condensers are quite expensive early game at least um, right so what happens this water block is here to irrigate this soil so that um, so that the flax seed can grow on it, because flax doesn't grow on um, on tilled soil that is not wet or irrigated. So yeah, basically, what happens here is you turn the machine on, it plants a flax, and it breaks it down again. Now uh, this has been explained several times before by different people, but in order to create a flax plant, you need one flax seed and one bone meal. Now when you use a flax seed and then a bone meal, the output is per average four string and four seeds, four flax seeds. Because of this, you get more EMC out than you put in, which gives you a surplus. And it's basically this surplus that we are harnessing. Now, when the machine is turned on, what happens is the first thing that happens um, is that a redstone signal is sent to this deployer, which is full of flax seeds and two string for some reason, full of flax seeds. Um, it plants the seed shortly after uh, a one tick delay using this repeater this deployer deploys bone meal so that the flax uh, the flax is planted and uh, bone mealed now then there's another repeater which is connected to jacketed wire just so it can stand in there uh, which is then connected via uh, redstone tubes to these two machines this is the block breaker and this is the transposer. The reason for this is that the only the bottom block I is needed to be destroyed in order for the whole plant to break off. The transposer just sucks the part the top part um, of the flower out, the product of the top part, because the the bo block breaker sucks the product of the bottom part. It is then sucked into here into these tubes. This condenser is condensing flax seeds. This condenser is condensing bone meal. There's a filter set to one flax seed and a filter set to one bone meal over here or two bone meal actually for it to go faster um, that every time the clock tick once, ticks once it sends a bone meal to this deployer and sends a flax seed to this deployer so that there's an equilibrium and it's um, yeah it keeps sending bone meal and flax seeds to the deployers that need it um, now if one of these are full it will go back into the into the energy condenser as you can see sometimes it does over here it doesn't because it only sends one flax seed at a time so it's perfectly synchronized um, I can prove this by going by taking out all of these oh it had space in my inventory okay see it runs perfectly perfectly fine even though I actually just took all of the flax seeds out because one flax seed is put in and it's planted put in planted put in planted right um, and then you have this energy condenser which condenses whatever you want I just put red matter it's basically the surplus that's put into here um, yeah and I think if you want to build this you can just kind of take a look at the design it's quite simple once you just get your head around it um, not too bad at all um, yeah that's about it thanks for watching and please comment like and subscribe and have a great day